Okay guys, um, welcome back to another YouTube video, uh, today I'm going to be showing y'all how to make pants, 5M chain pants, uh, everything you'll need will be in the description, um, but yeah, let's just get into it, so first, uh, you'll need your file, so you'll need to go to, uh, Google, Oprah, whatever you're using, I'm using Oprah, new tab, just type in Toby Base GTA VS at gallery full screen. Click off of female, click off of all, and you want to hit lower and just scroll down. Um, they should be somewhere around here. I don't think that's it. Um, right here, <clears> hit <throat> there. M MPM free mode zero one. So, you, if you, if you watch my other videos, you already know what to do. Copy from the A to the M. Copy. You can rem minimize that. Open up IV. GTA Windows. Uh, edit mode, yes. Search, paste, like the little search thing. Um, and this is like the other video, the masks. You gotta actually search for a file, and here you can just click the first. This one will show up. Now, as you can see, this says lower zero zero zero. You wanna find lower zero zero zero. Excuse me. Um. No, that's going up. Lower zero zero. Now you just make a file. Call it pants or whatever you want to. Drag lower zero zero from there. Scroll down. Till you find zero zero A right here. Just drag that from there. And now I'm gonna go up to mods, drag this over, click on the file. Click on the YTD, uh, hit export selected, uh, click right here, make sure it's a PNG, everything that you'll do is going to be PNG, save, save, or cancel whatever you want, now you can open up Photoshop, just go for that to load, alright, Okay, this is for thumbnail I was doing, but since I'm already in here, you just hit open on your computer and click on the file. Obviously, you're not going to be like this. You're going to have like the, actually, this is wrong. So I will just start first like y'all. So you're right here. You want to hit new file. You want to hit 1280 by 1280. Copy my settings for this. Hit create. And you're right here. Now you want to go to your files. Downloads, wherever you downloaded that. Drag the file over here. It should be like this. Okay. Now, um, I'm going to do a little bit more advanced. So, y'all can literally kind of do pants a little bit better. So, I'm going to go purple. And black. So just grab your paint bucket, new layer, right here, and you just want to click purple, make it all purple. And now basically everything you're gonna do, change colors, is gonna be on this right here, the purple. So what I want to do is I want to change the chain to um, black. So just make over here, opacity, just lower it. Uh, there's probably an easier way, but I, for um, for me, I'm just gonna just zoom in. Get my paintbrush, make it black, uh, make it a little bit bigger, about right there, and you just want to oh, kind of do this to it, just color it, as you can see I'm doing, so this is going to take a while, so I'm just going to be back when I finish it, okay, I'm back, <clears throat> so you see I did this, um, yours is probably going to be as perfect, but just have it like this and now uh 
what you want to do is for the feet this is like that's just a feet obviously it doesn't matter so I'm just gonna hit this little thing up here grab this oh that's horrible do this just make whatever color you want I'm just gonna go make the feet white just do that and then probably gonna be something like Give me something like right here. You just want to color that in white, also or whatever color you did for the feet. Just do it like that. So it doesn't it doesn't matter if it's perfect. Oh, oh, god. All right, now I'm gonna do right here. This is like on the belt, right in the middle. I'll show y'all, but I'm gonna have that. Like I'm gonna have the belt be black, so I'm gonna make this be purple. So you can just, and you don't really gotta edit that because it's already purple. So now you just want to edit the bell if you're gonna make it a different color, which is right here. You just want to take this tool, do that, paint bucket, make whatever color, which is for me black, and then the pockets. The pockets are probably gonna be the hardest you'll have to do. So the pockets can be the side on the side, and I'm gonna have them black. So I'm gonna. Zoom, so what you want to do is basically zoom in on these, grab your paintbrush, and go, oh, just do whatever color you want, and just, you know, color over for some reason, mine's not working, but, I'll find a way to fix that, so, probably just gotta do this, I'm just gonna, huh, alright, um, I'll be back when I fix this, so, Okay, I'm back. That was very stupid. So basically, right here, just make sure whenever you do something with this like that, make sure you deselect it, because if not, nothing else will work, as you can see happen to me. So just want to go back to what you're doing. Zoom in on the pocket that you want to color. Grab your paintbrush, make whatever color. You just want to follow the outlines. And just do this, whatever. Obviously, you don't have to make a full, like, color of it. You can do, like, right here, just certain colors, and leave the pocket a different color. But, yeah, um, I'm just going to finish all these pockets, and I'll be right back when I'm done. Okay, I'm back. So, the pockets are now full black. The belt's black. The chains are black. Um, so, the belt's black. This will be purple. The buttons will be purple. The feet will be white. So that's basically your basic design for it. Um, now, say you want to add lightning, which I'm going to do real quick. Just go to wherever you have your PNGs or whatever. Um, <clears throat> I'm working on getting all this PN, all my PN, not all my PNGs, but most of my PNGs into my Discord server and more. And so be on the lookout for that. Uh, yeah, that will be in my Discord. So if you're not in there, you can go ahead and join. Link will be in the description. So yeah, so I'm put your lightning right here. That little line right here is like the the bottom of the pants, I think, or whatever it's called. But yeah, you just want to click on it and duplicate it. That which is Control Z, well, Control J, not Z. Control Z is how you um, go back. So you just want to see here and do all this. So obviously, I'm using smaller lightning, so it's gonna look better, but it does take a lot more time to get organized with it and put it into uh, the right places. Oh. Like sometimes you might mess up with it and have to redo it. See right there, I just messed up and but all right, so right there, I'm done with that. With lightning, lightning looks like that. Obviously, it's a lot of copies, just don't gotta worry about it. Um, 
You can probably merge if you want, but I'm not going to do that for now. But now you just want to add text wherever you want. You could add text on right here. You could add text on the belt. You could add text on the pocket. I think I'm going to have mine on the lower pockets, these two. I'm just going to put Misty. Have it in whatever color you want. I'm going to do purple, whatever purple went. And Jesus. If you can't find your color, if you actually like, scroll off like I did, you could just go over here. Not that. Where'd it go? But first of all, I'm going to come back down here. You want to find... Uh, Right here, this little eye drop tool. Whatever you know, just hold it right there, and it'll take you right back to your color. And you could just up it to a bright purple, whatever it was. Go back over here. I'm gonna do this. Click on your text. Make it whatever size you want. Obviously, this purple is from pretty sure darker. Uh, whatever just want to line it up like that with the pocket make it a little bit bigger and just want to move it oh, don't do that. like that obviously it's not going to look perfect but I'm just going to control Z move it over here and rotate the other way so looks good like that okay um Let's say you want to add a PNG, which I'm going to add one up there. So I'm going to come up here, grab whatever PNG you want to use. I'm just going to use Bart again. Just want to make them a little bit smaller. Put them wherever you want them on the picture. Move them over like that. And now, basically you're done. But I want to add some sparkles to it so <clears throat> you can add any sparkles I'm gonna try and find if I have, see if I have a purple one. Oh, I'm gonna try to see purple I actually don't need a purple one you could use a black one which that's what I'm gonna use because I mean that's my secondary color just do this you can make it a little bit bigger or smaller you could also click on it and do control J but it doesn't look that good but yeah, obviously you can make it look the splatter a lot better but this will basically be your final product if you want to have the lightning over top everything not everything just really want to move your splatter down all the way under the lightning if you did a lot like me then it kind of just looks better in my opinion but yeah that's basically it so now you just want to hit file uh, export, quick export, as PNG. Click on this file. Save. Make sure it's a PNG, by the way. Save. Minimize this. Go to Open IV. Go back to wherever you had it, whatever you named it, file, whatever. Click on the YTD. Hit replace. Click on this. Save. Should look something like this. Save. And yeah, doesn't look the best. Like you see, I could have done purple change and it probably wouldn't look a lot better like sparkles I could make a lot smaller look better the purple I could change like it's just all about messing around with it it doesn't look good obviously because I mean I didn't get my time with it but you can do that right that that belt part right there is this right here um the sparkles you see how big they are you can make them smaller um, so yeah, I'm gonna just stick with this and I'm gonna give me like 